guess we were looking for different digging mechanisms. Mm -hmm. And so we ended up with ones that scratch, um, ones that use their teeth, uh, and ones that swim through the soil. And then the pangolin, which kind of, which has a, it's, you know, it has very adapted claws mm -hmm. for, for digging through hard soil, through ant heaps, actually. So, um, so those provided what seemed like within the, the narrow constraint of digging, a bunch of different biological solutions. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's very yeah. cool. Originally, we were thinking about creating curriculum materials to build robots to carry out a range of functions that would be helpful in a rescue situation. So we were looking at all sorts of animals that carry out different sorts of motion and do different things to the world around them. So we looked at lots of di different animals, but it was too much to figure out to focus in like it was mm -hmm. um, there were too many examples that it made it hard to do a real investigation of one specific like function in the world. So then we got serious about digging. OK, now we can really explore digging. How do different animals in different environments move that material? We learned a lot for sure. Mm 